Hi, let's run through a six-step growing cycle in the garden. Mm, starting with harvest, why not? And then going on to chop and drop after we've harvested. And then going on to getting worm castings, worm juice or something similar in as an additive for the garden. Going on to putting on some compost, then putting on some mulch and planting into the mulch. We've got a great example of this in our patch at the moment. This great looking Madagascar lima bush. This is actually three years now that this uh, Madagascar has been growing. And uh, this season in Sydney, it's about to go into its third flowering for some reason. Anyway, we're happy. We've already got some beans. Here we go with what you get when you plant one little seed and you get a mass of these beautiful speckled Madagascar lima beans. The second harvest for this year, 2021-2022, was um, around about 1.25 kilos of the dried beans. Pretty fantastic. And then we've uh, just looking at our little compost collection system in the kitchen. So we're aiming to get all our food scraps into the compost and into the garden. Uh, so this is a way of uh, keeping our organic matter on site. And also, I just realised the other day, it's also because we buy things from the shop, we're getting fruit and veggies that um, they come with uh, minerals as well. So we're actually boosting our mineral content as well when we're composting like this. Our laundry tub worm farms, which have worked out very nicely. The worms seem to be particularly happy in there. And uh, so that's where the kitchen scraps go. And I'm in here harvesting uh, some of the worm castings uh, and getting the worm juice out from underneath. And here's some of the plants that came out of this bed, uh, sharing the bed with the Madagascar lima. And uh, rather than just do actual chop and drop, I'm going to use the little battery electric mower to mulch, uh, mulch all these plants that have come out. And here we go, here's the actual uh, result of that big pile of stuff, uh, chopped up right quite nicely and um, ready to go onto, uh, onto the garden bed. And there's the chop and drop result. There's the worm castings, worm juice, and this time I put the food scraps on there uh, straight onto the bed and let them compost in place. There we go. After having uh, covered the, the bed in the compost that we've um, got in bags there, some composted manure and uh, uh, some other garden compost uh, we got from the big box store. We've got the bed ready to go basically. The final step has been to put the sugarcane mulch on uh, the top and uh, this is going to just help uh, keep the water in, uh, protect the uh, plants a bit, stop them from drying out and then what we'll do is uh, plant into, into the mulch here, just make a little hole in the mulch, pop the seed in, pop the seedling in uh, what have we got and we're starting the cycle again and of course um, since the Madagascar lima has been producing so much then it's uh, been good to give it a feed uh, so it can keep on doing its thing for its third flowering uh, for this year so there we go the six step garden cycle